Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to uh, make a custom PFP for your um, YouTube. Alright, so first I'm going to go ahead and show you what it looked like. So if, we actually, if I actually go into YouTube Studio right now, Return to Studio, I'm about to change my um, PFP to something very cool. Let me show you, let me show you. Let's go to branding and change. Oops. Alright, alright, so what you're going to do, what you want to do is go to Blender, link in the description for Blender, I will, then you, okay, so it would look like this, it will look like this, okay? Uh, but to make it show, I'm going to press this little half circle thing, and as you can see, it shows. So, basically, I'm going to teach you what to do to do this. Alright, so, uh, I'm going to put the link in the description for Blender and for the Illustrator and the Stick and Admin Badge. Uh, really, you just have to, I'm actually just going to put two links in the description, Blender, and then you have to put in, um, basically, you just go to Sketchfab and search something up, like whatever cosmetic you want for Gorilla Tag, you have to put Gorilla Tag or G Tag in the sentence, and basically, that's how it will work, and as you can see, I put my stick in a holdable spot, and I put the Illustrator badge right here. Alright, and you can make, um, you can do like, you can find these cosmetics, this is how I found the headphones. Oh, uh, this is actually really realistic, if you press the big circle, look how realistic that is. Yeah, but don't press this, if you want it just normally, just press the half circle. If you want it, like, just white, press the white circle, and then if you just want it like this, Press this circle. The third link in the description is going to be Nacho Engine's Discord server. That's how you're going to get, uh, you can get Metropolis map, you can get this gorilla player, and yeah. Alright, so now I'm going to teach you how to color in your gorilla what color you want. So what you're going to do is press on your gorilla monkey, and you're going to go down to material. You're going to press primary color, and when you're here, what you're going to do is you can basically just use any one of these and set it your color for me. Boom. And you can use a gorilla tag. This is the gorilla tag color shader. And over here is color and vision. So basically if you have it at zero, it's going to look like dark. But if you have it like, see, if you have this at like what? All the way up, it's going to be bright purple, like neon purple or whatever your color is, there's dirt stones, which I'll actually show you. This is a dirt stone, basically it just makes it white, again, makes it stone. There's lava, basically you can put how much lava you want. You can also make your custom lava. So basically your lava can look like this, or your lava can just look normal. Then there's ice, you have to put your lava all the way down. Also, your, if you put your lava, let me see, like, let's say, right here, it's going to look like this. Uh, that's just how much water you, uh, lava you put on. Then there's ice. It basically does the gorilla tag hunt ice. And basically, you can make yourself look very realistic with this. As you can see, you look very realistic. Or you can just be too realistic. And as you can see, it's just going to be ice or metal. 
then there's going to be lava emission. This will turn you white if you do not have any lava on. Alright, there's also glossary color. Okay. It's kind of weird, actually. Turn it off if you want to. I can go higher. Oh, yeah, just put the strength of it and put it all the way up or all the way down. Next, so basically, lava emission. Let's put lava on. Let's turn lava on. Basically, how this is like the brighter the lava. Now, for some reason, this looks very cool, to be honest. And if you were to have it all the way up, it's actually pretty crazy. It actually blinds me. If you were to have it all the way up, oh my gosh, I am getting blinded every time you do this. As you can see, this, you can basically just become the sun. <laughs> oh my gosh, my guys. Ow, 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 ow. So, yeah, that, that, that's that. And you can, like, turn it back down, which is all right. Turn my lava off. And as you can see, that is how you make a... And then you can, like, pose how you want with a pose thing. But I took mine out, so all the stance it can do is this. And I took the name out and put it right here and, named, and just named myself. To edit your name, you gotta select on it. You can also put the color you want your name to be, which I think is pretty cool. And what you're gonna do is select it. You're gonna go here, edit mode, and basically, you can just edit whatever you want. Of course, you shouldn't put your name like this, for example. If you just have it down, that's not the real deal type book. So we're just gonna put it in all caps and do that. And put like underscore hashtag or like any of this special characters. I think that's actually pretty cool. Or you can just do space. Um, so yeah, that's how you make a gorilla type PFP. I hope you enjoyed my video. Uh, like and subscribe. Try to get us to 200 subscribers uh, by the end of next year, maybe. This would really help me. Um, I can do my best here, okay? Hope you also you can get like rainy cosmetics. Hope you can do like rainy cosmetics. Let me exit out of the blender. Let's go here. And basically, if we look at, if we also join my Discord, which will be the probably another link. But this is my friend. An idiot. Can you say hi, please? G type fam. Yo, can you Stop say hi? Game. Stop. I bet he's shy. Anyway, so an idiot, I made this for him. Now that's on his YouTube PFP. It's also on my PFP now. Uh, so yeah. Yeah. Download the code for G guys. Um. Friend me if you want to, my name is TTH, G-Tag Family VR, or friend me with B999.49. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video, so bye guys.